look exhausted. It's not a sign of him. Police called. What about dredging the canal? Yeah, they've started, but they haven't found anything yet. Hey, no news is good news. You need to rest. My dad's already back out looking. He left early this morning. Yeah, finish right. Get your head down. Yeah. Guys? It's Nugget, it's text. What? Yeah, yeah, he, he, he said that um, he's OK. I, I know you're trying to find me, but I don't want to be found. I, I, don't, I don't recognize the number, but it's him. It's good. It's him. Come here. Ravi, we thought to see if you needed a hand, or we could take over for the morning. Yeah, look, you should really go home and get some rest, Ravi. <sighs> Even if it's just for an hour. Come on, you know we're safe now. Yeah, if I go home, I won't be able to sleep. <sighs> I keep trying this number. You should tell the police. Right, then, they might be able to trace the number, find a location, even if it's a burner. They probably can't if it's switched off. Yeah, but now it's got to be worth a shot. Yeah. Right, see you in a bit. Any luck? I tried, but... And they said it's possible the message isn't even from Nugget. Could be someone with the burn who's heard this missing. Well, why would someone want to do that? But you hear about it all the time. Randoms who just want to mess with people say it at the worst time. We're literally about to square one. But we'd know if the text wasn't from the Vinder. I mean, it, it sounded like him, didn't I it? I thought it did. But when the copper said that, I don't know. <laughs> Where would someone have got your number from, hey? No, it's definitely the Vinder. It's, it's got to be. The police said it wouldn't be hard to find the number of a local businessman who runs a busy restaurant. Prank. 